Hi, welcome back to Tony's British English. Now today we're going to explore a great British tradition. We're going to the pub. Ba -da! Now, to pubs in context to British culture, did you know that the English spend £30,000 a minute on wine and beer? There are 60,000 pubs in the UK. Pubs play a very important part of English culture. Let's go and drink a pint. Hi, welcome back. Now I'm going to order a pint of bitter. Here are the bitters. Now, you know they're bitters because you've got the pump. So these are manual. Okay, so here we go. Hi, now I've got myself a pint of beer. Now to be more precise, this is a pint of bitter. Now you can see it looks quite yellow, which makes it like lager, but it's not. This is bitter. Why is it called bitter? Well, it's called bitter because it tastes bitter. <laughs> now, it's made from hops. Many beers are made from hops. So in the brewing process, we add hops and they, the hops give it that flavor. Now in winter time, we generally drink bitter. Why? Because bitter is served room temperature. It's really nice. <laughs> In Japan, you only drink lager or yellow beer, which must be served cold. In England, we have two different choices. One is bitter, one is lager. We'll look at lager in a minute. Kampai. <laughs> now in England, we say cheers. In Japan, you say kanpai. Mm. Sugoi. I'm very lucky because I have a pint of beer in front of me. Yippee! Now, to measure this, one pint of beer is 568 milliliters. Now, beer comes in two sizes, a pint and half pint. Half a pint of, half a pint of. This one here, this pint of bitter, is about 4% to 4.5% alcohol. Now in England, this is a half pint, which is 284 milliliters. Okay, so I want to smoke, maybe. Smoke a cigarette, but I can't do that. I can't do that in an English or British pub, even a European pub, because you can't smoke in pubs. 
you have to smoke outside. So, cleverly, pubs have got these. These are called heaters. And we use them by pressing this button. As you can see, the heater comes on. Now, you only use the heater when you want them. And it's a bit cold today, so I'll put the heater on. Well, unfortunately, I've nearly finished my pint of beer. So, I'm going to order another one. Please. Please. I want you to listen carefully to what I say, because ordering in a pub, you have to be polite. Otherwise, you seem rude. So there are ways to order. Now, the first thing to remember in a London pub is you must never, 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 never wave. Never do that. Don't do that. Why? It's seen as very rude. You wait and you raise your eyebrows and the barman or barmaid will see them. But never, ever wave. They, you won't get served if you wave. You'll get served last. Okay, so listen carefully how I order a pint of beer. Let's go. Okay, now I'm going to order Doombar. Now Doombar is made by Sharps. It's good beer and it's bitter, really bitter. Now over here we have lagers. Now this beer is the same as you have in Japan. It's always served very cold. Not for me, because it's cold outside. Therefore, I want something a little bit warmer. This is very good for the summer, when it's hot. Yeah? Okay. I'm now going to order a pint of beer. Listen carefully how I order it. Ready? Hello. Could I have a pint of Doombar, please? Four pounds twenty. Thank you. Where can I pay? <laughs> no, thank you. Okay, that's the end of part one. The video is quite long, so what I thought we'd do would cut it so we have part one and part two. So thank you very much indeed for watching part one Please wait and hang on for part two. Okay? Thank you very much. See you. Bye.